Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In the previous video, I showed you Lumina Neo's new tools, Water Enhancer AI and Twilight Enhancer AI. If you haven't checked it out, you can click on the link here. And in this video, I will show you Lumina Neo's new masking features, Luminosity and Object Select AI. These new updates will be available very soon in this month. And for your information, the version that I'm using right now is the beta version, so some features are still under development. Okay, so with any further ado, let's get started. Okay, I'll use this photo as an example. And if you go to masking, you can see two new options, luminosity and object select AI. With luminosity, you can select the area in your photo by the highlights and shadow of the photo. Okay, so let me show you. As you can see, if you take a look at the background, the mountain area is a little bit overexposed. So if I reduce the exposure, the whole image will be affected or the curves as you can see the whole photo will be affected so right here I can use luminosity masking and select the highlights if you slide to the right side or the white area the highlights will be selected as you can see the red area is the highlight the same with the shadow if you drag it to the left side the shadow or the area will be selected okay now it's selected i can go to adjustments and adjust the curves okay if you take a look at the before and after as you can see only the highlights is affected okay let me show you another photo let's use this one and let's select the dark area okay slide it to the left side for the dark area to be selected and then right here i can play with the curve and i can add a little bit color as well Okay, if you take a look at the before and after, only the shadow is affected. Okay, it's a very powerful tool as you can see. And next, let me show you object select AI. Okay, I'll use this photo as an example. So with object select AI, you can select any object in your photo with one click. Let me show you. When you apply object select AI, you will see two options available, add to select and subtract to the select. Okay, so just hover your mouse to the photo and you can see the preview. The red color is the preview. So if I click on this rock, as you can see, the rock will be selected. And if I click another one, the selection is pretty precise and clean as you can see. The same with the sea and sky. If I click on it, it will be selected. So the same with the deselect, just select subtract and click on the object to deselect. Okay. If you take a look at the edges, the selection is pretty precise and clean as you can see. And like the luminosity, it's a very powerful tool. So let me show you another example. How about this photo? Okay, let's select the car. So you can select individual part like the door or the wheel like this or you can select the whole part and the same with the person you can select individual part or the whole object okay it's a very powerful tool as you can see and it's similar to mass ai the only difference is mass ai will separate the object in your photo by the category like this so it will separate the object by the category 
and object select AI let you select the object by one click like this okay so that was luminosity and object select AI and these updates will be available very soon in this month and if you are interested to get Lumina Neo you can click on the link in the description to get a discount okay so that's it for this video I hope you enjoy and learn something new from this video hit the like button if you like this video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in the next video. Mm.